up YouTube welcome back to my channel I know it's been a while since I posted a video I, uh, I know it looks like I went AWOL but I'm still alive so <laughs> man it's just been really busy but luckily I only have this semester and next semester and I should be done with college and then that leaves me with just work and then most importantly don't forget I didn't forget about you guys uh, just YouTube and then working YouTube that's all I gotta do but work YouTube in school it's like working three full-time jobs so I had to like kind of take a break from YouTube for a bit but uh, I had a little bit of a, a break this today so I figured I'd uh, shoot a YouTube video kind of give you guys an update plus it's a good day for a ride it's not freezing cold or wet and rainy so it's nice <laughs> yeah Florida was it's kind of funny Florida like for a long time was pretty cold and then it decided that it wasn't going to participate in the winter anymore, so it just stopped being cold. <laughs> now it's like, uh, it's, it's not too bad, it's in the like low 80s, which is uh, it's pretty good. So, and we have a, I have a lot of projects lined up. I have uh, projects for the Subaru, I got a new, new toy uh, that we'll probably get into a little bit later once I'm finished with, with college. Uh, obviously I'll have more videos with the bike, more videos with the Hawk. But uh, it's just a little, a little too busy lately. this much power between their legs <laughs> it's kind of cool though even though I haven't been posting lately I still get new subscribers all the time I'm still replying to comments so thank you guys for uh, you know still kind of showing me some love even though I've been kind of AWOL lately and if you're brand new to the channel I promise I'll post some more just give me a little bit of time <laughs> Is that a golf cart? Hell yeah, look at that thing. They're like, they're off-roading in that little, like, retention bond over there. Oh, hell yeah, look at that golf cart go. Hell yeah. Oh, it looks like security guard. Oh no, that's just a golf cart, they're just having fun. Hell yeah. <laughs> God, this V4, it sounds really good. It's like, it's like a very unique sound. Like, there's not many other bikes I don't think any other bikes or engine platforms that'll sound like this. That V4, the sound of the V4 is like such a unique sound. Like uh, really nothing else sounds like it. What I like about it the most is you still get like really low in torque, almost like a V-twin. But it's super smooth, like a like an inline four. It's it's it's, it's crazy. It's awesome. <laughs> They're uh, a little bit temperamental at times. I'll be honest. Sometimes it's just a uh, it's a feisty Italian. That's for sure. But uh, <laughs> as long as you uh, keep the right fuel in it, that's the biggest thing. Is because it calls for 95, and I think locally all we have is 93. So it's a little bit uh, challenging. But I think that's probably the most Thing, the thing that it complains about the most is the fuel but uh, I guess I chose this life so <laughs> oh my god there's so many potholes this is like a brand new road too but it's brick so that's what happens is like these potholes form so quickly with brick but it also keeps the speed of the traffic down really really nicely so I guess it's like a ongoing it's like an infinite speed bump glitch
big. Hell yeah. It's funny because uh, recently I've been talking to like somebody. The topic came, of lane splitting came up, and it's funny because you talk to people and they're like, "Oh, I hate traffic. I hate traffic. This sucks. This sucks." But they'd rather me take up a full car spot than to relieve traffic. They'd rather that be the case, but they hate traffic at the same time. Like, like what? <laughs> and the problem is, it's because. You have the group of people that lane split improperly, illegally, basically. Recently, somebody said, it's because you have to wait in line like the rest of us. What do you mean? What do you mean you have to wait in line like the rest of us? This isn't a line to like go get to the first, like it's not a race. And there's a reason it works everywhere else except for the United States. Literally everywhere else except the US. It works. If anything, I, I, if I lane filtered to the front of the, the line, the line, if we're gonna call it a line, <laughs> I gave everybody the freaking moon right now. It, it, again, it's like that the mentality of people that they they have to be first in line, even though we're going to two completely different locations. They have to be first in line, and then you know, obviously, the bad taste that people have from other people doing it illegally. It's just all this adds up, and it ruins it for everybody. But, you know, maybe one day America will turn around and we'll kind of understand the benefits of lane splitting, which is all there. I bet you there's a statistic somewhere that's, that shows the improvements that California has when, it, when they legalize lane filtering. Now again, there is another thing. I've noticed a lot, like a big trend is people will be lane filtering on the highway and then they get cut off and they get angry with them. At the same time, if you're going to lane filter, you're, you have to yield to everything else. Because you're not going with the normal flow of traffic. So if you, you have to make sure you're going at a safe speed to where if somebody does cut you off, you can stop in time. I just mooned everybody there. <laughs> oh man. Sorry if there's any families in a minivan. <laughs> gotta sit on my they got that'd be a good invention right there. Just make like little uh little like shirt holders for the back of your shirt. Oh yeah yeah. I guess you could just tuck your shirt in or wear a jacket. I should be wearing a jacket. The thing is, if I wore a jacket right now in Florida, I think I'd have a heat stroke. Yeah, that's probably just as dangerous as uh, riding without a jacket. Woo, my butt is hot right now. <laughs> oh, this bike is getting warm. <laughs> Woo. 82 degrees, went up 2 degrees. <laughs> There you go, nice cruisers. I'd do a cruiser, it'd be a nice like a uh, nice another bike to add to the arsenal. What I've been really liking in terms of like cruisers is the uh, the R18 from BMW. It looks really, really freaking just oh it looks really good dude. Especially that mystic blue, galaxy blue or something like that. Or galaxy dust, I think it is. I don't know. <laughs> Some crazy name, but it's got like this color changing effect. It's really really cool.
guys enjoyed this episode. I think we're gonna call it a day. Nice little cruise on the bike. Got to get a get out, stretch my legs a little bit. So uh, thank you guys for coming along, and I uh, hope you guys uh, consider subscribing. But as always, it'd be really awesome if you liked the video. It'd be really dope if you subscribe. But until next time, I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.